and and kind of going back to what I was talking about earlier about about your experiences mm-hmm. when you when you were in, in uh, when you were in office previously, you didn't have all of that. Oh no, you didn't have EITC. You know, well, we got not only did we get EITC federally now, but we also um, the Treasury um, has committed to to setting it aside to make sure it goes to tax refunds. So they can't use EIT, the the governor. No one you can't you cannot appropriate the EITC to go for anything else because uh-huh. Treasury is withholding it purposefully for tax refunds. You know, and 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 the tax refund situation is constantly improving because not only do we bring in all those federal dollars that created those um uh, local government revenues tax revenues that that allowed for these surpluses to pay these re- uh, tax refunds, but we now have EITC fully resolved and committed to only pay tax refunds. So it's a permanent solution. And Permanent. that's a solution that you were very instrumental in ensuring that it happens in that manner. Mm-hmm. And you know, I, I think one of the governor, the governor's messages was that they're paying out e- um, tax refunds now in weeks, right? Mm-hmm. And obviously now, now I have they a have better to. understanding. And she how, claims how to monitor it daily too. Yeah. How they're paying Come it out on, in weeks because man. already that EIT you serious? is no, they, committed. Yeah, they have to pay it out. Yeah. Otherwise, they, what they're going to let it sit in treasury? No, yeah. they have to pay it out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that's why they're paying it out. Yes. <laughs> I talk yes. about bait and switch. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's it's bothersome, you know. I'm-